From the outset of his career, LeBron James has sought to be more than one of the world's best basketball players. He has tried to be a global icon and a billionaire athlete. He hasn't yet achieved the latter, but there can be no doubt that LeBron James is a global brand. Here's how LeBron the athlete partnered with a number of prominent companies to earn cred as LeBron the businessman. Even before he entered the NBA, James signed a $90 million endorsement deal with Nike. After being drafted first overall, he quickly picked up a number of other endorsement deals with companies like Coca-Cola, McDonald's, Microsoft, State Farm, Upper Deck, and Cadbury. Oh, it is awesome. Early in his career, LeBron moved beyond endorsements to investments. In 2004, James and his childhood friend Maverick Carter formed the marketing firm LRMR. They soon bought a 10% equity stake in Cannondale Bikes. James and Carter sold their stake for a big profit. In 2008, he did the same, following it up with an investment in Beats by Dre. He got a small equity stake that would later bring LeBron some $30 million in profit when Beats sold to Apple this year. What up, Dre? 2011 was a huge year for the business of LeBron. James invested in the sports energy strip company Sheets. LRMR also partnered with the Fenway Sports Management guys, which brought LeBron an ownership stake in the Liverpool British football team. James also signed an Asia-specific endorsement deal with Dunkin' Donuts and Baskin Robbins. 2013 brought more LeBron business magic. He partnered with Chinese internet giant Tencent. Audemars Piaget put out a LeBron James watch. Samsung built an ad campaign centered around LeBron for their Galaxy phone. You in on Samsung? Yeah, totally. Maybe I'll do a cameo on the tablet. And they even created an exclusive LeBron app, which offered inside access to his life and routine. Whoa. Whoa. This year, LRMR signed on first round NFL draft pick Johnny Manziel. And LeBron's latest deal is with an innovative new sports marketing firm, Taneo Sports who also recently signed on two other basketball players who know a thing or two about being a global business brand, Kobe Bryant and Michael Jordan. As LeBron's business partner Maverick Carter told Fortune, LeBron is now at a size where he needs to be managed like he's a big company. 